Hey guys, so today I'm vlogging yet again, even though vlogmas is over. Today it's kind of a more interesting day since I'm getting out of the house doing something. You know, I'm gonna run some errands now. Trying Stefano sweatpants. I think these are wool blend. But I'm not very sure. So <clears throat> this is Stefano cashmere jumper, and Stefano cashmere is um like sweaters, the softest thing in the world. But its price is 180 euros. But what do you want when buying cashmere? It's always expensive. Okay, so I'm getting back to my car. I didn't find anything, although I have to admit, Stefano cashmere um, sweaters are just absolutely incredible. They're so soft and luxurious and the, just the softest things ever. So, I would really love to have one of these, but most of the cashmere stuff are from the new collection, so they're very expensive, like up to 200 euros, which is crazy for a sweater, but they're like, oh, they're so amazing, I have to wait for the sale. The ones that were on sale are not much of cashmere stuff, just wool, but, um, I mean, they're good, but have to find something that fits nicely and they don't usually okay i'm gonna go to max coffee now so roasted hazelnut light and my drink of choice it's such a nice and sunny day today it's amazing and the snow has melted already so the winter is pretty much gone it's so weird it would be minus 14 full of snow and so cold and then bam it's like plus four sunny no snow it's like crazy weather it's a bit mental here's the brush i got my christmas present i'm so excited and it is this monster here it is raventa brush active volume and shine it is this huge rotating brush with ions basically i wanted to buy it for myself but I was talking to my mom the day before Christmas. I said, there's this brush um, that I really want to get. And it's amazing. We could both use it. Let's buy, you know, one and use both of us. So my mom said, yeah, okay, let's buy it. Because she styles her hair with a, you know, big round brush and hair dryer. And just hurts your arm and whatever. So she said, yeah, okay, let's buy. And we could both use it. Um, so on Christmas day, um, uh, I received my present from my mom, which was a bathrobe, just a white snuggly bathrobe, but it was huge on me. It was like one size fits all. So it was really just too, too big for me. She said, you know what, just buy for yourself this brush. It will be your Christmas present. And I said, okay kind of awkward people around me so yeah I came today to buy it and I finally got it and I was gonna I was thinking of Babyliss one the big hair and they they have a lot of Babyliss like three different ones or something but I don't know I wanted to go for Raventa because first off it has two I think two additional brushes like smaller and bigger ones and it has iron system two iron boosters um, so I love that because irons add shine and smoothness to your hair they like smooth out all the frizz and makes your hair much shinier and it's um, much more powerful it's 1000 volts so yeah I'm very excited cannot wait to use I watched like a gazillion of videos on YouTube using you know babyliss or venta brushes to see how they style it so i will need to learn how to do it properly and then i'll have the most beautiful hairstyles and there's 
just tangle teaser laying around in my car. Okay, so I'm gonna go to some more shops now, to Zara. I'm at Promont. Everything is on the sale. One this necklace. Cute skirt for wearing with black tights and these boots. Very twirly. Look at this full moon, it's crazy how bright and huge it is. Hey guys, so I'm gonna give you an update and kind of do a mini haul video of what I got because I just did uh, posted my winter clothing haul so I don't feel like doing another haul especially I'll just show you what I got here and you can't imagine the evening I had was this most stressful evening ever it's crazy how much stress I had um, the story is I went to Promod store and I was trying some things I liked um, a few bits and bobs and then I didn't realize but I left my iPhone in the changing room and I went out I was kind of browsing in the stores and then I sat down on the bench and I realized my iPhone is missing I don't have it I ran back to promote because I thought well I probably left it there I asked to the sales, sales assistants there were girls in the changing room they said they didn't see it and I was so stressed out, like it really freaked out. Everything is my in my iPhone, you know, I vlogged all my pictures, my contact, you know, my chats with my boyfriend, everything. It's like all my life is on my iPhone and computer. <laughs> so you probably understand me, what I mean, what it is like losing a phone. And I went to the information, I asked the ladies to, you know, I said, I lost iPhone, please tell through the speakers, you know, um, inform people that if they find iPhone to return it to the information. And then I left my number and I was like, my mood was so down. I was like walking dead, like I wanted to cry, you know, my blood was rushing and I was walking in stores not seeing everything, I was so angry on everything. And then I was waiting for the phone call, nothing. I, you know, I browsed at Zara, the, the sale started, so it's pretty hectic there. And I didn't care about any clothing, you know, I was trying to, to shop to be okay, but I was really so stressed out. I went to... Uh, after a while I went to information again and said maybe the, um, the iPhone was returned, they said no. So the lady said do you want me to tell through the speakers again that um, one more time I said yes please. I was walking again, I went, the information was not far from Promote store so I thought okay I'll go to Promote store again ask maybe somebody returned my phone. I came and the sales assistant was smiling, she said Oh, you are, you came back for the phone. Yes, another sales assistant found it, but she forgot to tell, you know, before when I first came, probably didn't know that I was there. And they found and returned my phone and I was so happy. So yeah, I got this Raventa Beauty, which I cannot wait to try. I bought at the end before leaving the mall or shopping center. Um, this John Frieda products were on sale and I like them. This is Sheer Blonde. Um, enhancing shampoo brightens the full spectrum of blonde tones so I love the sheer blonde mask which I use as a conditioner it's my favorite one so I'm, I want to try the shampoo as well they have a conditioner but I thought I'll try shampoo because I'm running out of my Kerastase Crystallist shampoo which I love but I just want to try this one um, okay. Okay, the next thing I got was these heels that I posted on Instagram a while ago and now they were like half the price. I, it, as I said, it's hectic in Zara and I didn't really like anything, well I didn't want anything from Zara because I just bought a lot of clothing, I don't really need anything. Um, but I, I'm pretty sure when there will be a second round of the sales, everything will be so cheap. Then I will find something, because usually something that I never noticed, it happens. It, between those mountains of clothing, 
um, I always find something I never saw. So it can happen, but I got these heels that I wanted. They have a uh, kind of calf here, leopard print here, and then back is with gold studs. And I think they're so stylish and chic. And I love everything about them. But they're not the most comfy heels, so I'm a bit worried about that. I mean, the price is very good. They were like 35, 40 euros, so it's very cheap. But I don't know, since they are very stylish and definitely a fashion item, not something classic, I don't know how much I will wear them. Maybe I'll wear them for a year and then I'll get, you know, bored of them. So I'm not very sure whether I'll keep them. I can demonstrate for you. Okay, so here is how they look like. And you guys tell me whether you like them or not, whether you think I should keep them or not. They're definitely super cool and very chic and in your face. Um, very extravagant looking. I think, but as you can see, the arch doesn't fit me perfectly, so I'm not sure how far I would walk in this. But I love the thick heel, it's my favorite part. And the leopard, you guys know I love it. So, what do you think? Should I keep them or not? I would love to bring them to Italy with me when I go. Hmm. <laughs> Have to think about that. Now another thing I got is the handbag. This was extremely spontaneous. I actually was at the checkout buying the shoes and then I saw a girl buying this this bag and I saw this bag before and never really cared about it. But when I saw it at the checkout, you know, the, with the girl, I kind of thought it's beautiful. So I went and got one myself. It was so cheap, 30 euros. Um, of course it's foul leather and it has one strap here and it of course is Celine inspired and I love Celine bags are my favorite especially the trapeze ones so this one I mean it has fingerprints all over it since it's kind of shining but I love how minimal it is and this the size of it is just perfect I don't like huge bags so the size is very very good and yeah, as I said, it's so classic and I like how you click this and you open up, there's red inside and I'm, I think I'll definitely, oh, let me stand with my heels on. Um, yeah, the bag is so beautiful. I mean, I really like wearing it open like that. It's kind of effortless, you know, very chic, I find. And I like the one strap, how it's it's so simple and just clean, clean style, very modern. I think it's like what I would call modern elegance. So, what do you think of the bag? Do you approve it or not? I definitely like it for such a price, 30 euros. I mean, it's, it's really, really good price for a bag. And I will bring it with me to Paris, I think. It's so cool. And I love how the hardware is not gold, you know, not shiny, tacky gold, like on the shoes. I kind of wish the shoes were with silver studs, but it wouldn't go that well with leopard print. But the bag is just oh, so, so lovely. I will see you guys in my next video, whether it will be a vlog or a beauty video, I'm not very sure. Hope you guys had a great day and see you in my next video. Bye.